What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Pokemon Scarlet and I think if we look at the map the next thing we're gonna hit up I marked over here uh, This is for the star badge the fairy star badge and it's the fairy crew base over here I don't know if I'm high enough level and also I was looking at the, at the type chart fairy is weak to steel And I, I do have a steel move on my right shoe, but I don't know if it's gonna be good enough The accuracy is pretty pretty bad um, I can teach a steel move to a dog. That's a choice, but uh, let me switch. How do I switch this egg? Uh, chain put away held item and Then give it to right I need to level up right so give an item to hold So if we give him the the egg here, and I have some experience candies for him It might be wise to try to you know, I, I have these TMs do I have any steel TMs? What's helping hand? That's normal. I don't. I have uh, iron defense. I have uh, flash cannon. Give it to a Pokemon. No, what? Hold on. Let me look at those TMs in a second. I'm trying to give this thing an egg to hold. <laughs> there, there you go. Uh, egg. Egg. Lucky egg. Give it to. Which one? Okay, great. So, the, the question I have is, can anyone learn that steel move really quick? Let me look in my bag again. Um, which one was it? Metal Claw. Cannot learn. Uh, what was it? Flash Cannon. Okay, so yeah, I can have a dog learn Flash Cannon. Uh, I might do that. I might do that, but let me go ahead and move towards the area because maybe I'll level up Maybe I'll get someone else who could do steel. I don't know um, Let's just go towards the area if there are any trainers along the way I'll confront them. I feel like I've been this way though, but let's see have I talked to you before Surely I have I have So we're not gonna get in a lot of fighting before this next base, which uh, does concern me We I can glide how do you glide? There you go. I can just glide down to the base. That's awesome. Is there anyone to face off against though? I mean, I can't, the spawn distances are kind of odd. I can just get down there, my dude. Go right for it. Of course, that would mean that, you know, that would mean that I don't get enough training, really. Hi. Here we go. I could have just glided the whole way, but I just kind of wanted to scope out to see if there's any trainers in the area. North Province Area 3. I've arrived at my destination. How many people do I need to, to fight in order to get your reward? Uh, zero out of... Okay, I gotta get four. It shouldn't be too hard to do four trainers in this area, and that would help me level up some. Um, so, yeah, I don't know what I'm looking forward to doing. There's a trainer over here. But what level are these trainers? That might give me some indication. No, we're that's is that a trainer? That might have not been a trainer. No, it's him. Okay, never mind. All right, what's up, cool dude? Z Dog, Operation Starfall is going well. Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you say only two bosses left now? This whole experience has been eye-opening, to say the least. I'm glad I could take part. But I'm curious, Z Dog, what do you think of Cassiopeia? Uh, they're a bag of riddles. I, I think it's that one girl. Is that so? Personally, I don't think Cassiopeia feels any hate or resentment towards Team Star. No, there must be some other reason behind Operation Starfall, but what could it be? Well, I best get back to keeping watch. Call for me if you decide to take on the base, okay? Yeah, I probably will decide to take on the base because that's going to be next, I think. Been reading your comments. There's a guy over here. Here we go. Whoa. Excuse me. Hello, I need a new job. All right, uh, maybe working at the Pokemon Center near here would be more fun than my current job. So what's your current job? Esther the office worker, okay. Uh, Metacham is a fighting type, correct? Raichu's here. Have we faced off against the Metacham before? Uh, let me, let's check. This is a level 45, I'm a level, yeah, so fly would work. Let's get out of here. Skedaddle. Go up top. And don't worry, Raichu's coming back down soon. Because I avoided that attack. Kept going and crashed. What does that mean? 
Boom! Super effective. All right. There you go. Esther, the office worker, has been defeated. God, I got to go heal my Pokemon. Well, hey, you can apply for a job when you hit the Pokemon Center. <laughs> Uh, I will probably take that on eventually. I just, I'm gonna look for people to fight really quick. I hope that's okay with you guys. Ultra Ball! Uh, someone over here. What do you think this is? What is that? That's cute. Um, four. I gotta find four of them somehow. The power of music. You know, that's, you know, maybe if, if you could, I was thinking about this earlier, like if you could just add a type of Pokemon, what would it be? Maybe music or sound or something would be really cool. Wigglytuff. I think I faced off against those before, right? So, um, I haven't. Let's do Thunder Punch, maybe? This is level 50. That was pretty good. Here's Charm. Okay, my attack harshly fell. Let me fly out of here really quick. Peace. Double edge is gonna miss me. And I'm coming coming down with the smackdown. That was not good. Here's double edge, which is gonna severely injure me. And they were also injured by the recoil. Let me look at my back so I can have a hyper potion. I bought some of these at the store. Is this enough to fully heal me? I don't even know if it is at this point. It is. Another double edge. Which will also hurt you. Aha! So were you damaged by the recoil? or Yeah, you were. Great. Uh, let's just do a quick attack really quick. No, it wasn't enough. No! Dang. I thought it would be enough. I honestly thought that would be enough. The thing is, we're trying to level up Raichu, so whatever we do, if we bring out, like... Here, let's bring out A-Dog. I don't know. I need to heal or revive Raichu so that Raichu gets some XP from this. Hopefully, they stay paralyzed, but who knows. All right, Raichu. It's so unfair, I can't rename it. All right, good. Couldn't move because you're paralyzed. The other option is to, you know, give, instead of like clear smog or something, give a dog a steel move. Let's do a flame charge, maybe. That was good. And my speed rose. All right. Uh, Tatiana the Musician is about to send out Cricketune. I think if we keep the current Pokemon, this will be fine. My speed should be higher, and fire can destroy bugs, I'm pretty sure. Lava Plume coming up. Nice. All right, who's next? Who's next? Send out the cavalry. Uh, Grumpig. I don't know what a Grumpig is, but uh, let's just keep the current Pokemon. Maybe we can have some roast pork tonight. Ew. Yeah, I guess I could eat that. Um, some of these are effective or not very effective. Let's just try to hit it with a flame charge and hope that, you know, our speed increase. No, nope, that was terrible, dude. I gotta switch. I gotta switch. I gotta switch. I fought him before, so thank goodness. Calm mind. Do what you must. Who's gonna be strong against this guy? Special attack and defense have both risen. So, Pokemon wise. Oh, M Dog's Night Slash is super effective. That means H Dog's Crunch and Last Respects super effective. Everything from L Dog is super effective. Let's switch in L Dog here. Here we go. Bring it in. So how are you guys doing today? I've been playing my new guitar. I don't really know how to play guitar, but I can play power chords, and so I've been kind of recording a few things. I kind of want to release a song that features guitar. I don't know. What do you guys think? Can I use first impression? Boom, I can. I love it. Super effective. 
But I've been working on it. It's it's tough. All right, H Dog two leveled up. So wait, you know, I might okay bow to the power of music. I think uh, your 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 tune is up. What the heck, dude? Help! Okay, that, that was scary. If I pull up the Pokemon type chart, and believe me, I will pull that up. Uh, what did I get? Lonely Mint. Huh. Uh, let me see. Pokemon type chart. I, I oh, God. Get away from me. Get away from me. Oh, God. Help. It's right next to me. Should I fight this? What is this? Let's see what this is. What can you terrestrialize into? Oh, my God. He just went for it. Love. Fairy, right? That's fairy, right? We can test out my move. If that is indeed a fairy, fairy type, I could do an iron tail. See if it hits, see if it lands, see if it sticks. Oh, that was really good. Okay, so, but I mean, it has such a tough time landing, you know. Let me try to, uh, right you fell in love. Aw. Yawn. I'm drowsy now. Um, so let me try to do, can I not capture this thing? Quick attack. I'm in love though, that's not good. I'm in love. Can I not capture, oh yeah, I gotta break the terrestrialization first, right? Before I can even consider capturing, right? That's how it works. I'm freaking asleep, dude. So, okay, like I said, Pokemon type chart. If we wanna attack Fairy, poison also works, and I and that's the other reason why, you know, I was thinking about A-Dog, A-Dog already has a poison. So I may not need to teach it uh, a steel move. So Pokemon, a dog, get out here. You're going to learn. You're going to use clear smog, even though it's not a very good poison. What I can maybe do is give him a better poison. That way he still has poison. I don't know. Just an idea. Don't yawn on me. Stop putting everyone to sleep. I gotta hit him with this really quick. Uh, battle poison. Look in the move info. It's only a 50. Let's hit it. Oh, Shadow Ball might not be good against me, especially if you're coming from a level 50. Super effective, only took away half my stuff. Let's let's get him, please. There's Smog, thank you. That was super effective and did nothing. Okay, well, that sucks. Oh, we broke the terrestrialization, finally. I'm falling asleep, my dude. All right, well, uh, let's use a Pokeball, Ultra Ball, Net Ball. What are the details here? Dusk ball. Timer ball. Repeat ball. Luxury ball. Let's just go with ultra ball again, hopefully. I don't know if I'll be using the Sylveon, but still, it's kind of cool to have. Dang it, it just... Here comes Yawn again. I'm already tired, my dude. I need to buy more Ultra Balls. I'm running low. Come on, man, I'm so tired of these balls not working. I know, I know, a dog is fainted. All right, whatever. Choose next Pokemon, come on, anyone come out here. Swap in. <sighs> All right, this is freaking butterfly is watching me the whole time. Come on now, capture this, please. This part's so tedious. I really do not like the RNG aspect of catching Pokemon. I really don't. I don't know who ever thought this was a cool idea. I, 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 I just want to capture it. Come on! Okay, this is making me mad now. Shadow Ball doesn't really hurt me that much. I'm gonna freaking faint this thing if you don't if you don't let me catch you. Ultra Ball again, come on. What is wrong with these Ultra Balls? They don't work. Why? Moon Blast, no. Dang it. I'm not gonna lose my whole party to this. All right, choose next Pokemon. Dang it, H-Dog 2, swap in. 
This is getting ridiculous. I just wanted to level up. Not waste a million altar balls. I don't even want you that bad. Dang it! Moonblast again. Right, right. Super effective. Right, cool. I do, I'm not liking this. This is not great. All right. Uh, H dog, let's go. Does uh, does ghost work against fairy? It's fine against fairy. I'm gonna try like one more. I mean, I only have three more ultra balls. It almost stuck that one time, and I was really happy about it. Come on! I hate this. This is dumb. I don't care. A combine, what are you doing? Whatever. Whatever. Last respects. I don't care. I just want the XP at this point, for real. There we go. Okay, Phantom Force. Let's see what Phantom Force is. Could be cool. Uh, it's a ghost move, 9100. Okay. That could be interesting. I got play rough, fairy move, crunch, dig. I feel like I already kind of have a good a good move here though. And this one also makes me disappear just like dig, so I don't know. I'm just gonna forget it. And uh, we got some fur. Let's let's get out of here, dude. I cannot with this. This is uh, this is rough. What's this dragon thing? Is there any like steel thing out here? There's a steel thing. I could go over there and get that. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll go get that steel thing, and then like then I'll have a better steel move. Let me heal. I'm just not entirely. Uh, you know what I mean? I'm not entirely sure that I'm prepared for this uh, fairy base, is all I'm saying. So, it's been kind of a struggle. I, I need to buy more Ultra Balls. Like 20 Ultra Balls, please. Do I get like Premier Balls for free? Yeah, two Premier Balls on the house. Um, okay, so let's go check out. Yeah, yeah, stop. Oh, wow, where do you think this thing is? Here, let's, uh, let's just, we'll try over here. Is that, no, that's, who is this? No, this is, I thought this was the dude. Okay, yeah, such beauty. What's up? Let's fight. Such beauty only to be marred by ugly piles of junk. I can't stand it. What can't you stand, dude? Desiree the artist. Oh, wow. What the heck? I don't know what this is. Let's try uh, Iron Tail, why not? It's gonna miss, right? Yeah. I can't tell if it missed because of the type. Uh, let's try Iron Tail again. That was okay. Hypnosis. I avoided the attack, good. Let's try Thunder Punch this time. That was good. Fake tears, don't cry. My defense fell, that's okay. Let me do a uh, quick attack. Is that enough, you think, the quick attack enough? Yes, good. Got to tell. All right, nice. Right, you leveled up quite a lot, actually. Sorry, sorry. I guess I shouldn't have taken my frustration out on you. All right, let me go this way, I suppose. I'm not 100% sure which way to go, but maybe I'll find a trainer over here. Hyper Potion. I am finding some items, which is always nice.
Oh, that looks scary. Uh, where is the... Is there anyone else over here? Like... If I can find one more trainer, then I can get whatever the reward is. There's a trainer. I don't know if this one counts in the same area, though, but this is a trainer. So let's go see what's up. This is so boring. All right. My boyfriend and I came here for a picnic, but I guess I've got some free time to battle you. Yeah, I don't see your boyfriend anywhere. Come here, girl. <laughs> All right. Let's go villain. Is that a plant? Looks like a spicy pepper. If it is a grass type, then I would benefit from switching to a uh, fire type. And using like a lava plume or something. So let's consider it. All right, seat bomb. Yep, thought so, thought so. Lava plume. But she's got two Pokemon. That was okay. Sea bomb again. Sea bomb doesn't really work against me, my friend. Let's do another lava plume. All right. Skill villain fainted. Do you guys like spicy food? I went through a phase where I was like really into spicy food. Hatterene. Um, I don't know what Hatterene is. I still like it sometimes, but I don't. I no longer like really challenge myself that much about it. You know what I mean? This looks like a fairy, so I'm just gonna use poison. Wow. Yeah, I guessed it right. Again, I feel like I could teach myself a better poison. Like if I look at the TMs, maybe there's a poison that's like really good. Like something that I could like really use. All right. But I've tried, you know, I've gone, you know, the, the Hot Ones show, I, I bought like a whole bunch of their sauces and I ate them. I even did the, the last dab sauce, which was not as bad as the bomb sauce. The bomb is awful and terrible and it painful. Uh, last dab is a pleasant follow-up to something like that. So, hey, right, you leveled up. That's great. Uh, oh, how exciting. All right, so I do wonder... Whoa, excuse me. Hold on, I'm gonna go grab this really quick. Ultra ball. I don't know if she counts. Well, let me look, let me mark on the map really quick. Where's the steel thing that we're, we're looking at? It's, it is right over here, oof. I don't know if I can get there. Let me travel back up to here. Maybe that would be the better way to do it. First, let me travel up to here. Maybe there's a, maybe I've done four now and get that prize. Let's see, have I done four? I have, there we go. I got Leaf Storm, okay. So here's the question, can I teach a dog a different poison move? That, that, this is the only one that's craftable and he can learn it, but it's only a 40. Oof. Uh, that's the only one he can learn as well. Dang, I could teach uh, this 8100, but I don't have any of those materials. Dang, oh, but wait, do I have one on me that like maybe I've already picked up that I don't need to craft? That's a good question. Thanks for asking. Oh, A-Dog needs a heal. All right, what do we got here? Uh, we're just looking for poison, right? Which is purple, nope. Poison is gunk shot. Ooh, 120, no one can learn that one. Toxic spikes. Uh, that doesn't seem like a tough one. Vino shock. No one can learn that one. Great. <laughs> Poison tail. Fifty. No one can learn that one either, huh? All right. Well, sucks to suck. <laughs> Let's heal. <laughs> Maybe I'll just go in there. Maybe I, maybe I don't need to, need the steel thing. Maybe, I, maybe my one steel move is enough that only hits three out of every four times. And that poison might be, not, not, I don't know. 
How do we get up there, dude? This is what I mean. Like, like up. That looks like such a long, steep thing. Maybe if I go. Oh, there's so much of the map I haven't been to. I'm gonna travel here and see if this helps me get to where I need to go. Then. Maybe I'll be able to see it in the distance, and I can just fly right to it or something. I don't know. It's gonna be. I did. I, I didn't. I did not, did not mark it. But I could mark it. So we know where the one thing is, so I did mark it, never mind. My bad. Uh I'm gonna travel oh not that way. Hi. Uh I just I just need that real quick. Thank you. <laughs> I think it's going to be over there, yeah. So let me just let's just glide to it if we can. I think it's right over there. Holy cow. I missed that. That's okay. Comet shard. That's interesting. All right, whatever. We're just going to go through the water. We can go through the water. If this is a steel one, then we can do what? That's a steel? I guess so. Uh, it was a terrace. Ter okay, so... Uh, if, it, if it is a steel, then we're going to want fire, fighting, or ground. So A-Dog would be a good guy to send in. So let me change my Pokemon. Uh, I will send in A-Dog here. And then, um, challenge as a group. It's only a one star, though. This may not be worth it at all. I don't know. This may not be ready to, ready at all, honestly. <laughs> I honestly can't tell you. This might be such a weak Pokemon. I don't even know what level it's going to be. This may not even be worth it, is what I'm saying. But nevertheless, we'll still, you know... Oh, close up. Wow, okay. This thing looks pretty cool. Such a weird one. It's a deerling. I can't terrestrialize myself. Whatever, lava plume it is against this deerling. This might have been a mistake. Wow. Wow, okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. This is no big deal, was it? I'll catch it, whatever. I'm just gonna use a regular bulky ball. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna matter. I, I feel like I'm overpowered. Whoever is here with me, they're like, I didn't even get a shot. All right, well. Well, 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 locked and loaded. I, there's no way this dearling is any any good. But, <laughs> but all right, sure. <laughs> maybe a mistake to go in. I mean, not really a mistake, but maybe there's other steel around on the map that I can go to and try to catch. And maybe get something that's like at least three stars. I don't know. So I got a deerling. It's a normal grass with a steel terrestrialize. No nickname. What level is this? How can I tell? All right, cool. What was that? Level wise. Level 12. So yeah, like, like I did, okay. Uh, okay. I came all the way over here, and I guess that on its own was fine. If we look at the map, surely there are more steel ones that I could get, right? There's one right here. This could be interesting. What's like? What's this one? You know, like 
Does it say what level they are before I even go there? It doesn't, but let me, uh... Let me try here. If it's just a one star, I'm not gonna get it. But this is a, you know, an important part of the game that I've kind of neglected. I got like something once and it was great. But you know, not everyone's gonna be a, a winner. How do I even get up there? Can I even glide up there? I don't know. I got a figgy berry. Um. Man, that's so high up there. Oof. A rare candy's good. I can use that to level up Raichu. If this isn't worth it, I'm just gonna call it quits. You know what I mean? I'm like, I'm, dang it, dude, get out of here. He's only level 26. You should get, you should get XP for running. <laughs> Like, oh wow, you 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 did that the, the smart way. You can you get XP, congratulations. How the heck do I get up there? Literally don't know how to get up there yet. Uh ouch. Help, whoa, 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 help. Help indeed, dude, what the heck? This is not gonna work. Oh wow, yeah, one of these. I don't know what this is, but this is the second one of these I found. The the stake, yeah, pull the stake. That's the second stake I found. It crumbled and vanished, good. Just don't show it, just tell me what happened. Uh, let me look on the map again. If I want to get over here to this steel thing, I think I need to start up up here or down here. Actually, yeah, no, that's where I was, right? I'm so confused. I think if I go up over here, sorry, we're going back. We're going back. I'm going to turn to the right, and then I'm going to try to climb up here. I'm sorry that like th this feels like I'm wasting time, but I'm really not trying to. I really just want to be well prepared. So if I go up over here, this looks like the way to go. What? <laughs> oh gosh, okay. I think if I go up here, this will be an easier path to get to it. Oh. Gotcha. Give me a little coin. The problem is I still don't know if this will be sufficient in order to get up top of there. I might need like, I, I still think that maybe like this guy will get some sort of climbing ability that I just don't have yet. Cause I don't know how to get up there. Like it does it, it seems like there's no possible way to get up there, right? Yeah, I, I, I'm just gonna have to, I think call it quits. In the sense that I don't, I don't know how I can get up there. Dang it! Run. A little flittle right there. All right. Oh no! I can make it. Wow! I th I didn't realize I was going up. I thought I was just kind of flat for a while. All right. Let's see what this is. If this is one star, I'm out. This is one star. Okay, never mind. Uh, well, you know, we could always look at the map again. This this might just be a colossal waste of time. But there's a steel over here, so we could go look at it, see if it's worth our while. There's like two. Okay, actually, there's two steel over here. I'm gonna mark one. If none of if neither of these work, then I don't know what to do. Like honestly, I don't know how this works. If neither if neither of these work, I don't know how this this aspect works. Am I supposed to just get a one star and level it up? Don't think so. <laughs> but maybe, maybe that is what you're supposed to do. So uh, let's head over here. Uh, this is a nice green area. So I keep thinking I see things in the grass.
Dang it! Move! I honestly, I, I wish that you had to click them to encounter them. I really don't like encountering things without me specifically wanting to do it. You know what I mean? Like, let's fly. Oh, let go, let go, let go, let go, let go. What's that? Heck yeah, swift. <laughs> no. All right, it's over there. This is this is the way to avoid the encounters. You're not going to run into anything if it doesn't if you don't walk. Of course, if this one is nothing, then I'm, I don't know what I'm going to do. Well, there's one more. But if the next one is nothing, then I don't know what I'm going to do. Get out of there, dude. What the heck? This is also a one star. Uh, do they make two stars? Like, for real. Like, do they make anything stronger than a one star? Am I looking at this wrong? Okay, well, let me... Uh Let's look around. I'm trying to get up on top of... Whoa, what is that? What the heck is that? What is this? Faint writing is carved into the shrine. Herein lies sealed the ruinous tablets. Dude, what? <laughs> what? How do I get on top of that mountain? <laughs> this is not the right answer, I don't think. Uh, all right, well. Well, I am out in the middle of nowhere, it feels like. Have I not? I have. I don't know if I've been here. I don't know what I'm doing up over here. There might be so much more to this map to explore than ever before. This, I don't know if the structure of this episode's gonna be very good. All right, let's see what this is. That's not even a steal. But that's a poison. Let's check out the poison then. Maybe we can get a really good poison thing. Oh, dude, a four-star poison? All right. What's poison week two? Uh, ground and psychic. Ugh. I do have a ground move. I guess we bring in... Uh, if we do it as a group, it should be fine. I have a dig. And, and I... This one terrestrializes into a ground if I need to, right? Challenges a group. All ready to go. Let's go. I hope this works. This is interesting for sure. Huh. We'll look at the steel one too, but I mean the, the poison might be really adequate against, you know, because poison is strong against fairy, so... Could be interesting. Let's see what this is. What the heck is this? Can't even see what that was. Wow. Is that an ice type? Let's do a super effective dig. Let's get him. I'm not even going to be here, so... See ya. Ah, I missed it. We're on a time limit. Let's go. Did I, did I get him? I, I think I got him. I don't even know if I... I let's go. Let's go. I, I can't do anything. It started to snow. Dang, I, we may not be able to get this guy, dude. All my teammates are dying here. What the heck? What the heck? Are you kidding me? Wow, this guy is super strong. I may not this may not be up my alley. 
Oof. Uh, okay. Alright, uh, let's... What the heck do I do? Uh, what about last respects? Or no, let's just do another dig. I don't know. Maybe we'll get him, I don't know. We're keeping up with time a little bit. I'm afraid I will faint though, but... All right, got him, got him, got him, got him. You're not gonna target me again, are you, with Ice Hammer? He is. All right, well, I'm gonna need to heal then. Uh, I can't. Can I terrestrialize? I can, perfect. Here we go, I'm gonna terrestrialize and dig. We're keeping up, we're keeping up with the time, so that's good. I'm probably gonna get hit though. And I don't know that I'm gonna like that, but whatever. Go! <laughs> get out of here. How come no one else is terrestrializing? All right, come on, come on, come on, come on. I did terrestrialize. That wasn't bad, I guess. Ice Hammer's gonna faint me though, right? When can I come back? Because I can't heal. Do I come back? Tell me I can come back from that at some point. Someone else terrestrialize. All right, come on, get me back, get me back, get me back. Someone else terrestrialize, please. Are you guys idiots? I don't think I can terrestrialize anymore, so we're just gonna keep doing dig. I don't know if we're gonna keep up, but time's almost out, honestly. I thought we would maybe get there, but it looks like we're just not quite there yet. These guys aren't even terrestrializing. I don't think we're gonna get it now. I thought we were, I thought we were right on, right on track. What about last, re you think, what about last respects? Is that gonna work? Let's see. Nope, not really. Come on, come on. Oh, did we get him? No. I thought we maybe would have gotten him. Go faster. Everyone else hit them, please. He's almost gone. We broke its stance, but we're not gonna beat him. Oh, come on, that was such a nice... Oh, oh did I do last respects again? I think I think he's, he's gonna get away now. Dude, he's almost there. He's almost there. Oh, so freaking close. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. Come on, don't leave. Wait, did we get him? Can we catch, capture him now? Can we capture him now? Catch, yeah, ultra ball. Let's go. Awesome, I caught this thing. Or I'm going to catch this thing, I think. Awesome. If he stays in. Wow, I caught that. Okay, cool. And I got a lot of experience candies too. I thought he was gonna get away for sure. Wow. All right. What is this thing? Is this is this is an ice thing? It's an ice that terrestrializes into poison. It's a fighting ice that terrestrializes into poison. What a thing. Uh, no nickname yet. What level? Let me just put it in the box. I'll check on it. This might be what I bring in. I don't even know. Could be cool. So if it's a fighting and we're up against fairy, fairy is actually strong against fighting, so that kind of sucks. I didn't know that was gonna be a fighting type, but 
Ah, uh, dang. That's that really sucks. But but if I terrestrialize into poison, it's not going to matter. But I can only terrestrialize during the last round, so I might need to bring him into the last round. Let me look into the boxes really quick. What level is this guy? This guy is level 45. Okay. So he's about on par with the rest of us. It's such a weird combo of things. I'm glad to have him. This guy's only 38. Dang. I was thinking toxicity because I have... This one has poison. I could bring him in instead of Raichu, but Raichu has this iron tail that kind of works sometimes. Uh, so last but not least, before we go on to the main main event that I'm here for, uh, we're gonna go look at this uh, steel. If it's a good, if it's a one star, we're gonna skip on the steel. It's up here. I'm in an area that I haven't even really been in before. All right. It's just a one star. Oh, I don't know if I did it right. So look at my boxes. Who who do I not want to bring in? Fairy is strong. I don't want to bring in H Dog too, because there's man. I really don't even want to bring in this guy, but I might need to bring him in for like the finale or something. You know what I mean? So maybe instead of uh, instead of. That could be fun, maybe. Such a weird, crabominable. All right. We'll see where this goes. Uh, let's travel then near this area here. Sorry, this is like a long episode. I think we're ready to take it on. I think that, you know, we're, this is about as good as it gets for us. I did get some new candies. I'll probably give those to Raichu. Let me go ahead and heal up everybody. It just depends. It, just, it honestly just depends at this, at this time what I'm going to do. I'm going to terrestrialize into a flying type, which flying type isn't going to be anything. You know, like, if, if, when I terrestrialize into flying, like... Electric and ice and rock can get it, but I'm gonna going up against a fairy unless they have one of those things. And then uh, let me go ahead and give some candies. Uh, we got oh a large one. Give that to uh, yeah. Give that to you. Awesome. Level 48. Then let's give these... Uh, got four mediums. Give them to him. Awesome. Level 50. All right. A better item to give him instead of the XP than... Sorry, this is just me taking my time here. Um, we could have him hold... Ice, that's interesting. Float stone, damp rock, heat rock, smooth rock, shell bell, rock moves. I don't think we can really hold anything else. I mean, we can, but I, I don't know. Honestly, the black belt thing is always pretty good. Expert belt. Uh, super effective moves. Oh, yeah. Well, give it give it to him is what I mean. There we go. All right. We're going to hope that, that, that Raichu can carry the weight here because I leveled him up specifically. But if not... You know, we'll see. We'll see what happens. Let's do this. I will return later when it is time for the young master's piano lesson. Until then, please give him my regards. Y yes, Mr. Harrington. 
Hmm. It's me, Z Dog. And who might you be, young man? A friend of the young master, perhaps? A young master? Ah, I see. Since you seem unaware, I must inform you that this is the base of Team Star's fairy crew, the, the Rukba squad, led by the young Master Ortega. Uh, Mr. Harrington, I don't think we're supposed to be giving out that information. No? Then please accept my apologies. <laughs> Do you have any idea as to who this young man might be? He's no friend of ours, you know. I think he might be here to try to take us on. Oh, understood. In that case, I'll take it you're an adversary of the young master. That's right. Uh, is that so? Well, then that leaves me with one last thing to ask you. Huh? Would you be so kind as to indulge me in a quick battle? Yes. Splendid. Then let us begin. All right. Let's go. Pokemon Trainer Harrington. Morgrim. What is Morgrim? See, Iron Tail is super effective if it lands. If it lands. So roll of the dice in a way. It, it landed. Excellent. Lucky me. What else? What else? Hatrim. I, uh, I, I'll keep Hatrim. Is it, is it another fairy? Or what, what is this? It looks like a fairy to me. Iron Tail. Oh, I can't use the same move. Oh, dang it. Okay, well, let me choose a different move then. I'm going to use Fly just so I can get out of here, dude. Calm your mind. All right, fly, nice. Now we use Iron Tail. Oh, the thing about this though, if I terrestrialize with Raichu. Quick attack. Then it's I'm not gonna be I'm not that my my move isn't gonna be it'll be super effective, but it won't, you know. I'll be a flying type. So my my move won't necessarily be that much good. Well well. Well well indeed. I need to heal. An outstanding performance. However, be aware that young Master Otega's battle prowess far surpasses my paltry skills. You would do well to take care. Now, if you'll excuse me, hasta la vista. <laughs> he was a grunt. That gentlemanly guy used to be the director of the academy, I think. At least that's what I heard. Now he's like tutoring the boss or something. He shows up here sometimes to take the boss to his lessons. Hang on, why am I explaining this to you? There's no doubt doubting you're here to make trouble, so I gotta let everyone know. Hasta la vista. See ya. Okay. Someone's giving me a telephone call. I see the guard has been dealt with. Good job. That base belongs to Team Star's fairy crew, the Rook Rukba squad. Their boss, Ortega, is the mechanic of the team. He may be the youngest of the bosses, but his battle skills are no joke. Underestimate him, and things will go south for, for you quickly. He's also a real lead from the back type. He gets his grunts to do all the dirty work for him, but his weak point is his short fuse. Get him good and angry, and he'll march out into the front lines to deal with you himself. In terms of tactics, there's nothing else for it but to take down all the lackeys he sends your way. Just tough it out until Ortega shows up and go from there. Ring the bell on the gates once you're ready. Time to wipe the Ruck Boss squad off the map. All right, will do, will do indeed. So, uh, yeah, potions, potions indeed. And I want to I wanna make sure to give... I think if I, if I want three people to be here, I'm, I'm going to move him there. That's probably good. Is grass weak to fairy at all? Let's see. Grass and dark. Uh, dark is weak to fairy, so I don't want to bring in M Dog. I guess I'll bring in. Oh, no, but that's also dark. Oof. Maybe H Dog. All right, these are the three I'm gonna send in. Let's ring the ding the bell. Let's go. All 
All right. Code red, code red, Operation Starfall alert. Everyone get into a position and defend the boss with all you got. And rest assured, Intruder will deal with you without the boss's help unless you manage to beat 30 of our Pokemon in 10 minutes, that is. Good luck with that. They're so easy to do. All right. Team Stars Pokemon, let's go. Bwong. Get him. Get them all. Send them all out, my dude. All right. Yeah, get him. Excellent. Awesome. Okay. Uh, over here then. Th these seem kind of easy. I'll be real. Okay. I can only send out so many. All right, there you are. Just in time. Halfway there. Th these fights are so easy. I got, I got 10 minutes to do too. It's so weird. They should really just give me five. Probably. All right. 22. All right. This is good. This is good. That was that was super easy. I did it in like less than two minutes. So who's gonna be mad at me? Our defenses are breached. It's up to, all up to the boss now. All right, hopefully I don't die. Let's go. Nice flag. All right, Ortega. Let's do it then. Huh, so you're Z-Dog, okay. Talk about underwhelming. I was expecting someone, I don't know, a little more beefed up. Well, whatever, I don't care who you are, not like I'm gonna lose to you anyway. If you think fairy types are all about cuteness, you're in for a nasty surprise. Let's go. Ortega, Team Star. All right, go right you. Is this a fairy type? What is that? I promise I'll play nice, so don't blame me when this battle sends you blubbering back home. I'm glad I leveled up to 50. Okay, Iron Tail, I guess. That hits him. Is it? That wasn't even super effective, dude. What? What is Azumarill? Oh, great! My attack fell. Hold on. Azumarill is a, oh my gosh, it's a water fairy. So my thing didn't even work. Uh, water, okay, I don't know. Water, it did, didn't work. It, it, steel, steel works against, no, steel doesn't work against water, but electric works great. Oh my gosh, electric works wonderful. Thunder punch him. There you go, holy cow, okay, lucky me. I'm glad I brought Raichu. Okay. Uh, Wigglytuff, I think Wigglytuff's fine. Assuming my Iron Tail hits. It's super effective, let's go, but Thunder Punch is also regularly effective. Iron Tail's gonna hit. All right, super effective, great. One more of those and it should be good. Play rough hurts, but he might be paralyzed. I'm gonna heal because I don't want to lose Raichu right now. 
Oopsie, did you just realize how unmatched you are? If you want to give up, now's the time. I'm fine. Uh, let me go ahead and use a hyper potion and hope that uh, this thing is paralyzed. I can do a nice hit on him next time with another iron tail. Okay. Play rough sucks, dude. Um, I can only hope that he, he is paralyzed and doesn't play rough with me. Dang it, stop it. This is annoying. I, oh, crap. I'm just using it, I guess. Okay, good. Good. He's gone. Okay, I need to heal, like, immediately, though. All right. I guess we'll keep the current Pokemon. Do Dox Bun? What is it? I'm, I'm going to look up what a Dox Bun is. I don't even know what it is. Uh, Dox Bun is a just a fairy. All right. So we'll keep the current Pokemon. And I'm going to heal. And then see what I can do to him. So they got a play rough move coming up again. Have a taste of this slick move. Bet you can't handle my Pokemon's adorable strength. I don't know what move this guy has. I don't know what he's... Play, God dang it. Play rough sucks. I avoided it. Great. Let's do Iron Tail then. Please land. Oh, I was going to miss. Dang. Dang. Play rough really sucks. Uh, What if I fly out of here? Would that buy me some time? Let's see. God, play rough sucks. All right. Is there anyone who's... Anyone I have who is... Oh, yeah. Fire type and poison and steel are not good against... So I'm going to bring out A-Dog, honestly. I'm going to switch over to A-Dog. Oh, he's so weak, though. Gosh, I've got to level him up. Oh my gosh, I think I'm on the right path then of just healing over and over. This is tough, man. This is really tough. I'm just throwing out hyper potions like candy. Okay, crunch. That's not as bad. Let's hit him with Iron Tail. Come on, Iron Tail. What? What's baby doll eyes? My attack fell. No. But this is a special attack, right? Dang it, Iron Tail failed. I'm gonna fly out of here, I think. Let me try another Iron Tail. Thank you, it hit. Oh, God. Oh, no, I got fainted from Play Rough. Crap. Okay, I'm just gonna switch someone in. Hey, dog, so weak, dude. L dog. I'm, I'm gonna do first impression. Swap in and do a first impression. I don't care if L dog gets fainted. That was terrible. Why? <laughs> okay, okay. Super effective, but. But what? I don't know. Sucker punch? Yeah, these. these everything that, that L dog has is not good. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna burn him out. I think. Actually, let me uh, let me go ahead and go to my bag and revive Raichu. Yep. Okay. Super effective. Fine. This is a little bit tougher. My party composition isn't as good as I hoped it was. Uh, let's just switch into M Dog, and we'll do a. Uh... Well, I need to heal. Um... Use that on Raichu. Hopefully, M Dog can 
be helped with this. Whatever. Um, let's do this critical move. Baby doll eyes again, dropping my attack again. Nice, critical hit. Of course it is. All right, so this is where it gets confusing for me. I think I wanna try this crab move. Let's see, let's see what happens. What the heck, why is my team on the ropes? That's totally not fair. Probably because I'm spamming hyper potions. <laughs> All right, Misty Surge, I don't know what that is. Mist swirled around the battlefield, oh no. Well, oh God, this is so tricky. Maybe I'll stick with M-Dog for, for the moment. Let's just, let's just stick around for a second here. Steel Roller is not gonna be kind to me. I, why'd you have steel? Here's Flower Trick. That was terrible, cool. All right, let's go over to Raichu and hope my Iron Tail lands. I'm so worried about this right now. This is not great. Magical Torque. Okay, that was terrible. Great, and I'm confused. Iron Tail. Dang it. Oh my god. This sucks. I guess I'll try my new Pokemon's Terrestrialize. I don't have a poison move. What? I don't even have a poison move. Are you joking, kidding me? I cannot believe this right now. All right, I have a poison move with this guy. I cannot believe this. I, I bought, I bought a, wow, what a mistake. This is terrible, clear smog, hit him. Hit him with this, this is gonna suck so bad, dude. Oh, but not, not very effective against me, huh? Because I'm fire. All right, all right, maybe we can whittle away at this. I wish I had something a little bit better, but whatever. Come on, A-Dog. Yeah, all right, all right. Okay, Magical Torque doesn't bother me that much. A-Dog snap, thank you. Snapped out of his confusion, another clear smog. He's halfway there. Here we go, here we go. This might be the winning strategy. I cannot believe I brought in that thing. I didn't even realize he didn't have a poison move on him. What a weird episode this is. I always, I, I'm having a lot more trouble with these bases than I am the gyms. Nice. All right, what, what's next? Hit him again. Magical Torque doesn't bother me that much. All right, I'm gonna probably heal just so that, you know, I'm, I'm not like halfway dead. All right, there you go, Hyper Potion. All that wasted on Raichu, dude. I thought, thought it'd be great. All right, let's, let's hit him up. Let's hit him again. Doesn't bother me one bit. Almost there, one more hit of that and we'll be good. All right, here we go. Can't believe this is what it was. All right, Rev of Room fainted. It worked. Good job, A-Dog. Heck yeah.
Ugh, how could I lose? What the heck? Just deal with it, man. This is a flashback again. About a year and a half ago. Ugh, what the heck? Your toy car didn't budge an inch, huh? I told you it's not a toy, it's called the Starmobile, and I was up all night building it. The problem is clearly that we were not giving it enough juice. You designed this thing to be powered by two Charcadet, but it's just too heavy. That's such a shame. I wanted to see the looks of, on our bully's faces once we got it moving. I'm sorry, I really thought it would work. Come, good fellow, tis no occasion for melancholy. Why, to make such a remarkable contraption by thine own hand, genius thy name is Ortega. Yeah, well, if there's no point, if it doesn't work, is there? If I knew all that effort would have zero payout, I'd just have asked Mother to buy a car for us. See, this is why people don't take you seriously. You say some stupid things, you know that? What? <laughs> Mel, cool it, will ya? Yeah, but how about no? I mean, we even put this in the code for crying out loud. When we started Team Star, we swore to quit relying on our parents for, or bags of cash to fix our problems for us. D did you forget? If that hunk of junk doesn't move, get it moving. If we're short on juice, just gotta crank up the power somehow. It doesn't take a genius, man. That's easy enough to say, Melly. Do you have an actual plan? Yep, I'm gonna train up my Char Cadet and have, have him evolve. Their boosted firepower will get the Starmobile moving, no sweat. But the hour of Operation Star is nigh at hand. Will you succeed in time? Oh, I'll get it done. Melly, wait. All right. You know, Mella shoots her mouth off an awful lot, but she means well. I know. God, it sucks. This sucks. <laughs> I hate myself for losing, but I also can't get over how awesome you were in battle. If any of us squad bosses are defeated, that means we have to step down, and going against our code would make me a traitor to the team. Ah, fine. Not like I have a choice anyway, so take the badge already. You better treat it with the respect it deserves. All right, great. There you go. Harder than I thought it would be. Also made the wrong decisions along the way, but we still ended up with a victory. I'm not done yet. Here's my favorite TM2. Feel free to marvel at how awesome it is. Dazzling Gleam. Great. Oh, my goodness. And just so you know, you are the worst. Like the most annoying person ever. But I get it. You're super strong. I'll admit that much. You even busted up my Starmobile. Young Master Ortega. Mr. Harrington, I guess it's time for my piano lesson, huh? As it happens, I just lost my boss title, so I'm all good to head on home. Uh, actually, a different matter brought me. There's somebody I would like you to meet. He's a distant acquaintance of mine. The name's Clive. Okay, what's your business here? I want, to I want you to tell me something. You're the son of a wealthy family and heir to a major apparel company, so why join a group like Team Star? What a question to ask someone you just met. Well, my answer's the same as everyone else in the team. It's because I was being bullied. So the academy really did use to have an issue with bullying. Who would guess, right? The school is all rainbows and butterflies these days, and the bullies from back then don't even go to the academy anymore. Why? What happened to them? As, for, as the former director of the academy, I believe I am best positioned to answer that question. Mr. Harrington, about 18 months ago, the members of Team Star confronted the students who used to bully them, and an altercation broke out between the groups. Though it did not escalate into a major incident, the altercation nonetheless caused a scandal of hitherto unknown proportions. As a result of what occurred that day, the students who had, been, uh, per who had perpetrated the bullying dropped out of the academy one after another. But, but, there aren't any records of that anywhere in the academy. No, I should imagine not. My former deputy deleted all records of the incidents, you see. What? Why would anyone do that? Just as I was puzzling over how to best deal with Team Star in the aftermath, of the incident, a certain student came to see me. The student declared that they would take all responsibility for the team's actions. In exchange, I requested that I exonerate the other students of Team Star for any blame. Huh? No, no one told me that. I accepted the request and agreed not to take disciplinary, disciplinary action against Team Star. Then I assigned 18 months of overseas study to the student who took responsibility for the team. A year and a half of studying abroad? <laughs> this was not intended as punishment, you understand. Team Star were the victims, after all. I wanted the student to take some time to rest, so I had them return home to the Galar region under the pretext of overseas study. Around that time, however, the former deputy director took it upon himself to erase all traces of the incident from the Academy's servers. It appears his intent was to shield himself from any blame. So he tried to cover up the whole thing. That's terrible. After we discovered what he had done, I dealt with him appropriately, of course, but the inability of myself and the rest of the teaching staff to prevent this terrible act also represented a great blunder on our part. 
I accepted the blame that lay at my feet and, re and resigned from my position as director. The rest of the teaching staff then joined me in handling, handing in their notices. So that's why the current teachers were all brought in a year and a half ago. I understand my actions have caused you a great deal of trouble. You have my sincere apologies. Hang on, Mr. Harrington. How come you suddenly decided to talk about this now? Young Master Ortega, Team Star cannot carry on in this current fashion. I merely wish to give you a chance to chart a better course. Well, there's no way I'm abandoning my friends and going to school without them. Not after we've come this far. Your friends and Team Star must mean a great deal to you. Isn't that obvious? It's because, you know, they're my greatest treasure in the whole world. All right. Cassiopeia is probably going to get in touch with me then. All right. Roto to 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 to. Z Dog, it's me. I take it that Ortega handed over his star badge to you then? I see. With his boss no longer around, the Ruck Boss squad is as good as finished. Even Ortega. I'm sorry. We're almost there now. Just one boss left. The operation's been a huge success thanks to you, Z Dog, and Clive has also performed admirably as your support. I remember him saying that your acquaintances, have you known each other long? Yeah, I guess for a while now, I guess. Well, he's clearly a, rel a reliable friend. He almost reminds me of the gang back in the day. Which gang? As you know, Team Star was formed by a group of students who were being bullied at school. Shortly after forming the team, these students, none other than the squad bosses themselves, confronted their bullies head on. The outcome was a re resounding victory for Team Star. Though you could hardly call it a contest. The bullies didn't even put up a fight. They all bolted from the battle. The first chance they got, scared spitless of Team Star. The bullies then dropped out of school one after another. And Team Star ended up the villains of the story. But that's neither here nor there. Forget I even mentioned it. Now, about your reward. I'll transfer some LP over to your phone as promised. Alright, we're getting a lot of lore today. Make good use of those TMs. They should help you take down the last remaining boss. My supply unit rep will be along soon to give you the bonus reward. There we go. Um, here I am. This thing again. Ah, stay in your Pokeball for once, will ya? <laughs> Ugh. All right, now what? Wow, Team Star went through all that, huh? They just wanted the bullies to go away, but then they became the bad guys in everyone's eyes. What a joke. The students, the teachers, they're all so messed up. If even just one of them had been paying attention when everyone else was getting bullied, they'd have been able to tell right away that Team Star wasn't the wrong, one in the wrong. But I guess the big boss was the one who urged everyone to face their bullies despite knowing how messed up the academy is. What a massive idiot creating Team Star and just hoping their plan would miraculously work out. You really think so? I'm sure of it. Well, here's your reward. All right. The next boss is the very last one. We're counting on you, Z-Dog. So we got one Titan, one star base. What else do we got in this game? Let me know in the comments below because we are going to be moving on towards that. I do thank you for watching. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit Zach Scott. Dot shop. Come back next time for more.